That's right. I know. Oh, I know. I want to get over to meteorologist Peter Sherwood sure now. Peter, you're tracking some storms headed our way, but it could bring rain for us. Right. I want to show you here severe storms moving across Alabama and entering into Georgia. We're seeing a lot of cloud cover associated with this system, and we expect it to continue to weaken as it moves towards the north and east. So clouds expected to build in for the lunch hour. We could see some showers develop for some of our western areas leading into 3 o'clock. Rain will grow a little bit more widespread leading into this evening around 5 and 6 o'clock and spotty showers possible for tonight. Likely to see drier conditions leading into tomorrow morning out the door. We could see some wet streets, but most of the rain should be out of here Tuesday morning. Wednesday is going to be a dry one. Rain chances picking up into the end of the week and leading into the weekend. I want to show you here the system is expected to bring severe storms across the Midwest and there of low pressure uh, area of low pressure and trailing cold front. The tornado threat is up there. A level one out of four severe risk in place for Iowa, Illinois and Missouri. A severe storms likely to extend as far south as Texas. This system is going to move into our region, but weaken as it moves into North Carolina, likely to be dry Thursday morning, but into the afternoon, some showers will be possible. And this front is going to move towards the southeast, but still allow showers and thunderstorms to ride in from the south and just remaining stationary as we head into Saturday. So do plan for rain on Saturday. And as of now, we're thinking we're going to be dry on Easter Sunday, but things could certainly change with this boundary just to the south of us. We could potentially see some showers creep in. I want to show you outside right now. Things are quiet. We have clouds building in. Temperatures are warming up. Earlier we were in the 40s and now we're at 54 degrees in Raleigh and Durham. Come this afternoon, we're warming up into the 60s around the lunch hour, heading to 73 degrees today. It is going to be a mild one out the door. I think if you want to get outside today, maybe get the kids outside to get some fresh air. It is spring break. We are going to see pleasant conditions for much of the afternoon with that rain building in later into the evening. As we check out our seven day forecast, you can see here the big warm up that's on the way heading to 81 degrees tomorrow, 86 degrees on Wednesday, 84 on Thursday, but that boundary just setting up across our region Friday and Saturday and high pressure system to the north. We are going to see cooler temperatures build in likely to be in the 60s on Friday, the 50s again on Saturday, but warming up into the 60s as we head into Easter Sunday. I wish we could slide that Tuesday, Wednesday <laughs> forecast to Saturday, Sunday. <laughs> right. If only. But if only, but we can't. That's all right. Thank you. <laughs>